Hierarchy of Influencers It's important to realize that the four influencers impact, in a hierarchical way, the behavior that we choose. In other words, one influencer often trumps or overpowers another in terms of its ability to shape our behavior. In most situations, our environment trumps our experience, our peers trump our environment, and our self-explanations trump our peers. To illustrate this point, let's consider an example. When we were growing up, our parents might have always driven slowly, slower than the posted speed limit, our experience. When we went on our first long trip by ourselves, we may have started out by driving like our parents. However, we quickly noticed that while we were driving at 90 kilometers an hour, which was 10 kilometers an hour under the posted speed limit, everyone else on the road was driving at least 120 kilometers per hour, our environment. We slowly increased our speed until we were driving at the same pace as everyone else. Then, one day, we had to travel from the office to our work site with our boss, our peer. Because he wanted to get some work done, he asked us to drive. We made sure that we didn't go even one kilometer an hour over the speed limit the entire way. Once work was done, we drove back to the office, dropped off our boss, and got into our vehicle to head home. That's when we realized that we were late for the big concert we were planning to attend. We told ourselves it's unlikely that we would get stopped by the police, so we sped the entire way. In addition to realizing that, as we move up the hierarchy, each influencer has more power over the preceding one, we must be aware that the amount of control we have over each influencer also increases. This means that we have more control over our environment than our past. We have more control over the people we spend time with at work, our peers, than we do over our environment. But the influencer that we have the most control over is our self-explanations. Thinking critically about how we explain things to ourselves and interpret what we hear and see will enable us to make better, safer choices and, consequently, exhibit safer behaviors.